Hi there. So we were talking about an F scale, um, uh, a major scale, and, and also some uh, pentatonic scale, which, ha which only has five uh, degrees in it. And then a blues scale, which adds another uh, degree in there, so six, so, so seven, six, and five. Uh, but uh, let's look at the F major scale first. So that one, pretty simple. That's going to go F, G, A, B flat, C, D, E, F, and then again, G, A, 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 uh, B flat, C, D, E, and F. And if I think about those, so those are my letters, right? But I think about them also as my finger position. Remember, first first finger, first fret, second finger, second fret, third finger, third fret. So we're just going to go first fret, third fret, open string, first fret, third fret, open, second fret, third fret. That takes me back to the F again right now. Uh, third fret, open, second fret, third fret, first fret, third fret, open, first fret. And I can think about those also uh, as degrees. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one. So three different ways. And I can also think about those, of course, as uh, intervals. So tonic, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. Now from the top, so that's my octave. Now it's my tonic again. So tonic, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step and half step. So four different ways. So be, to be able to play that F major scale in the first position is pretty handy. So, uh, so I would, so I would uh, focus on that and practice it. You don't have to practice a real lot, like, like all in a row, but if you're practicing this kind of stuff, Think about doing it if, while you're thinking about it in different ways, intervals or degrees, you know, or the note names or finger position. The thing to avoid, of course, is to think about it in terms only of finger position. So we can also play that as a pentatonic scale. If we wanted to play the minor pentatonic, it would be the flat three. So that sounds like this. So that is one, Flat three, four, five, flat seven, one, flat three, four, five, flat seven, and one. Then I can put, since my, my, my finger's kind of ready to get to it, I could also go up to the flat three here. Flat three, one, uh, flat seven, five, four, flat three, one. Uh, flat seven, five, four, flat three, one. Bum, 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 bum. So if I think about it in terms of the, the so those are the, of course, the, the degrees. Uh, now I can think about it in terms of the finger position too. So first, fourth, first, third, first, third, first, third, first, fourth, first, fourth. That's an easy one, right? So that's a very common uh, a kind, of a, uh, kind of a pattern to make. So and a lot of times you'll hear me just sort of noodling around and I'll, I'll so, okay. so all that is is just going back and forth between the three, the, uh, uh, the, the uh, I'm sorry, the four, the, um, the uh, five, 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 seven, one flat three, four, um, one, two, three, four, five, one flat three, four, five, flat seven, one, bum, 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 bum. and you can do all of that just with, with two fingers, first and third finger, right? And they're only separated by, by a whole fret from the, uh, from the five string. Bum, bum. So you can see that all I'm doing here is playing First fret, third fret, first fret, third fret, first fret, third fret, first fret, third fret, third fret, third fret, third fret, and and that would be for the F. 